So what I did in my off weeks, I only came back on the 13th of December from the States. Uh, I just, I didn't touch a club for two weeks when I was home. <laughs> I needed a break. <laughs> it was a lot of golf last year. Um, but I'm happy to be back here in Kenya for the first event of on LET. Uh, I think I'm going to use this one a little bit as a warm up um, tournament. Uh, I played a little bit, a couple of days in Spain to prepare for this, um, but I'm just going to go with it and see how it goes and prepare for the next tournaments coming up. And how do you sort of do it like, because around there it's like, it, it can be quite quite dry, quite around there and quite windy as well. How do you sort of deal with that? Yeah, um, so it was good to play some practice rounds uh, just to see how the course reacts. Um, it's still quite firm compared, I mean, like the last few years was also pretty firm here, but um, you just have to adapt a little bit to it. But I think uh, I managed just fine today, so uh, I think I have a game plan for the rest of the week. Brilliant. And after like such a strong season last year for yourself and getting your first like win on tour and stuff, like how how are you looking to build on that this year? Um, yeah, I mean, like last year was a pretty good season. Um, I, I was very consistent throughout the whole year kind of thing. Um, I kind of uh, saw my coaches this winter and we worked on a few things um, just to keep the momentum going and um, I think I can just build on next year, the confidence is there so um, I'm, I'm looking forward to this year. And how much like is that a confidence boost, obviously like getting LPGA status like, as well, like, how much does that make you, like, you realise how you compete against like, people both sides of you know, the Atlantic? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, on LPGA, it's going to be a lot different, I think. Uh, it's also a higher level than LET. But um, I proved to myself that I, um, I'm capable of doing, I mean, I'm capable of playing on that level. So um, it's going to be very exciting. It's going to be a cool experience, I think. And I'm just going to go fully committed to it um, in the tournaments I, get, I can get into because with my category, I don't get into all the tournaments, but uh, so I still play. You'll still see me out here on the LET a little bit, so don't worry. <laughs> really, and, and obviously, like with such a busy year last year as well, like like has that helped you sort of like how to schedule for this year as well? Yeah, I always felt like I was a little bit burned out by the summer because I played so many tournaments because I just wanted to play everything. So I'm gonna look into that a little bit more so I take a couple more breaks so I'm ready for the summer because those are the most important tournaments of the year anyway so um, I'm kind of like planning on that so we'll see and what was the best thing you did in winter break what is the best thing I did over yeah. winter break <laughs> um, well I, I bought a house last year so I'm uh, I'm kind of like getting into that a little bit <laughs> buying a lot of furniture and stuff but um, no it's exciting it's a it's a cool it's a new step I mean it's like a big step in my life so um, yeah well, that's kind of what I did yeah. <laughs> that's really fun yeah, yeah.